A notch lapel gray suit is the most important suit you'll own and is the quintessential foundational piece that'll work regardless of your age or your body type. Hi, my name is Ashley Weston. I'm a celebrity menswear stylist. This video is part of my men's wardrobe essential series. Today, I want to talk about a two button notch lapel gray suit. If you don't already own this, we need to fix the situation immediately. The reason why I love it so much is because it works in every situation from your first interview to funerals, weddings, and every formal event in between. You might be thinking, why gray? Gray is so boring. The reason why I chose gray is because it's a neutral color where you can inject your personality via colors through your accessories like your tie or pocket square or your shirt colors. Classic rookie mistake, men think that they need a loud suit, that this is what evokes style. It couldn't be further from the truth. Classic men's style is all about the details, the subtle details. So a gray notch lapel, two button suit is what you want. Why a notch lapel? Well, you might even be wondering, what the hell is a notch lapel? I don't wanna bore you with all the details, so instead, check out my article on my website. The reason why you want a notch lapel is because it's timeless and it's universally flattering on all body types. The alternatives are a peak lapel, which is very aggressive and only works on certain body types, or a shawl collar, which is a time and a place kind of thing, and also, you should never wear a shawl collar suit. A shawl collar tux? Yes, maybe. A suit? No. So why two buttons? Well, I've got some clients, let's just say they're older clients, that have three button suits that they absolutely love that they bought in the 90s. It looks horrible on them and elongates their upper body to their lower body. And I've also have younger clients that are like, let's do the one button suit. And they think that looks great. And I just tell them, I'm like, look, in two years, it's not gonna look good. So let's talk about fabrics. I've seen so many articles out there talking about all the different kinds of fabrics and it's just unnecessary and confusing and not something that you really need to know. There are just two things you need to consider. The first is the sheen of the fabric. Avoid anything shiny. That just equals tackiness. You don't ever want that. Instead, go with a matte fabric. Second consideration is the type of fabric. If you're gonna be wearing a suit more than a handful of times, then you want to go with a wool or wool blend fabric. It'll last you longer, look better, and it'll be more comfortable and breathable. I do have to say though that a wool fabric will influence the cost of your suit. But if you're wearing a suit more than a handful of times, it's justified and it's worth it. If you're not gonna be wearing a suit very often, only a less than a handful of times a year, then and cost is a consideration, then go with a polyester blend suit. It is cheaper and it'll do the job. Regardless of whatever decision you make, whether it be wool or polyester, make sure that your suit is tailored perfectly. If you wanna know how your suit should fit, then check out my fit guide. All right, so I have Michael here to help me demonstrate the different ways you can wear a gray notch lapel two button suit. Thank you so much for Thank helping. Thank you, an opportunity. Yeah, so you look so sharp and this is a classic combination that I absolutely love. I have you in this beautiful gray suit by Brooks Brothers, it's a red fleece, as well as this white dress shirt by Brooks Brothers. I paired it with a black tie and a white pocket square by the tie bar, and we added this beautiful IWC Portuguese watch and ended it with this gorgeous pair of black dress shoes by Allen Edmonds. So I'm gonna get him in another look, so give me a second and I'll be right back. All right, so I've got Michael change. Now, the reason why I just switched out his ties because I wanna show you that with a gray suit, it's really a neutral, so you can play up the color of your tie. 
So I have him still in the same Brooks Brothers suit and shirt, but we switched out the tie for this burgundy tie and we added a tie bar as well as a pocket square all by the tie bar. We kept the same IWC watch that he has on and then I switched out the shoes for some brown Allen Edmonds. This is why I love a gray suit is because you can go from black or brown dress shoes and really play with the color of your tie. So give me a second. I'm gonna change him into the final look. We'll be right back. All right, so this is the final look. And it's, I love this because it's casual, but still really sharp. We kept them in the same suit, but just switched out the dress shirt for this black t-shirt by Armani Exchange. We added a black belt by Allen Edmonds, and we put him back in those black dress shoes by Allen Edmonds as well. Like I said before, this video is part of my Men's Wardrobe Essentials series. Thanks so much for watching. Check out my website for a more in-depth article that includes all of my product recommendations and the best ways to wear your suit. And remember, check... Ah! <laughs> Subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos like this. I'll see you in the next one.